what it just did, it's kind of a cool to see that even without access to pandas or Python or anything like that, try to figure yeah. out just using SQL, which is very, very hard to do. So that's an early MCP. That's only an MCP. I think there are some more LLM enabled right. versions of like Jupyter Notebooks and stuff that yeah. would probably take that mm -hmm. next level and get the pandas. I'm using the Crystal DBA MCP. Gotcha. There's a bunch of them out there. This is the first one I tried and it seemed to work with the toolkit that I was okay. using. And again, my use case was I want to run everything on my local device. Right. So I'm trying to analyze data and I'm on a plane at 30,000 feet. I don't have to go remember my SQL. Because you can get bogged down by a syntax error and you yeah. forget what you were trying to accomplish. It gets in the refining the tool itself rather than getting to the answer. But if it gets to you an answer real quick, I think it's BI tools on steroids at this point, if you're looking at it, because often you would get a question in your mind and it's either figuring out what is that chart showing, which fields it's pulling from to directly show that. And that, that's the next thing I would love to have is a tool like this where yeah. I can get the data and say, hey, go give me a chart. Because yeah. any of us who've worked in Excel, particularly if you're a recovery consultant, yeah. you can make Excel do a ton of different things from yeah. data analysis to showing all kinds of mm -hmm. graphs. Many things it does, it should not do. But if you put enough effort to it, it will. And like that visualization piece is always the next thing that you get to is, okay, so I know the data, but mm -hmm. what's the picture look like? And the MCSB is not just limited to Excel or databases. You are unlimited in yeah. terms of interaction. We were talking about a use case that you had this morning where someone was looking at an MCP to call another LLM to oh. expand a query. Let's say an MCP has a complex maths problem solving ability, but when you get a question, it's a little bit complicated for it to solve. It calls another LLM to break it down into yeah. smaller chunks, then it solves it and combines and sends it back. Again, these are emerging topics in MCP world, but I see that as a plus because now you can easily integrate with weather, maybe ticket booking, availability. You can do a lot of things without having to have a browser integration and yeah. all that stuff built in. Maybe the software of the future will be MCP enabled.